Hey, what's up everyone? Are you frustrated with the iCloud activation lock, also known now as iPhone lock to owner? Well, this is not your fault. I don't blame you. It's very annoying, uh, especially for those who bought a secondhand iPhone or any iOS device and it came with the activation lock. I know you might feel like, oh, I just got uh, played. Uh, yeah, I cannot do anything with this device. But luckily, I'm gonna show you how you can unlock it. Uh, I bought this uh, device on Marketplace. So you know, <laughs> it happens a lot in those type of places in the internet. But don't worry, I'm gonna show you how you can get rid of it. I just want to clarify that all you need is a device with a browser and an internet connection. So the first thing that you're going to do is head over to safeunlocks.com. It's gonna look like this, the website. They have this wizard, they have other features, you can check it out, it's up to you. But for this video, I'm gonna show you their iCloud Unlock tool. So head over to services. Now you see the second one is the iCloud Unlock. We're gonna press on it. You can see, unlock any Apple device from iCloud activation lock. You'll, be, you'll see that you will need to fill out some information. This is very simple to do and let's do it together guys so first we need our name and an email address i just want to make sure that you know that um, you need access to that email because you will receive some information i'm gonna show you later and explain later all right now we need to select the device model over here you can choose between iphone ipad apple watch or ipod all, all of these are available on the tool and pretty much works for anyone doesn't matter the model if it's an iphone 4 if it's an apple 13 doesn't matter the ad updates itself very often so don't worry about it uh, in this case iphone now we have to select if we want to verify this device using either imei or serial number if your device happens to have the sync tray on it as mine does as you can see here uh use the imei number so let's do it imei number uh, you might be wondering how you get the IMEI number. It's very simple. So take your device. You have the uh, screen here. Turn it off. Turn it back on. And you'll see this uh, very little eye icon. Press press it. And you'll see that you have an IMEI number. As well, you have your serial number. But for this purpose, we're going to use the IMEI number. Go to the enter your IMEI or serial number here. And enter it. All right, make sure it matches because uh, this is the only way to verify your device. After you verify all the, your information, click on I accept the $1 fee to sign up and unlock my device. Now just click on proceed and you're gonna land on the following page. Your order ID is, well, you have your unit number for this matter. I got this and you will be required to obtain a membership ID to continue. If you don't know how to do it, don't worry. They will explain you absolutely everything. They have this uh, very short tutorial and they show you exactly, step by step, how to sign up for the uh, membership ID. Just gonna show you a little bit of the process. You're gonna click on I know the robot, continue to sign up and simply follow the, the tutorial. And I'm gonna show you in a bit the next step. Awesome, I just finished signing up for my dumb ID. Go to your email. Remember that I told you that you need to have access to the email? This is what it is for. You'll receive your membership ID in here and this will allow you to activate your order. I'm gonna show you in a second when I get the first email. Perfect, I just got my first email, membership ID. Hey Nick, thanks for using Safe Unlocks. Remember, sheet ID has been verified. Please use it on the order page to get started. So take that ID with you, copy, go to the order page. You'll see here, enter it to continue. Let's paste it. And if everything is correct, you'll see this button that says start your order. Simply do it. And now your order is now in progress. Head back to the email, go to your inbox, and you will receive a second email containing your dumb ID. So let's wait for that email.
perfect. I just got my second email. It contains a dummy ID. It says, your dummy ID was generated successfully. Please enter it here on the de please enter this ID on the device you have selected using the IMEA number. This dummy ID does not contain any type of personal data. This is good because this uh, dummy ID does not contain any type of previous data from other users, so it's really safe. All right, so you'll you'll have an email and a password. So take your lock device over here and. What we're gonna do next is to enter the same information on the device. So you will see here, email, password, and here, enter the same information. Great, I just entered the same information. Now I just hit next. When able to activate, don't worry, this is due to Wi-Fi. So press try again. Well, if this happened, don't worry. The activation or iPhone lock to owner is fired. So enter the information once again. All right, press next again. And you see that data and privacy, this is the first settings. Now just continue with the with the same process. Perfect. This part is very important. Where it says apps and data, go to don't transfer apps and data. Now forgot password or don't have an Apple ID. Um, set up later in settings, and don't use. Uh, just continue with the setup until you reach the home screen of your device. And now you see, welcome to iPhone, <laughs> great news. Get started. Now let's go to settings and you see, sign up uh, to your iPhone, press on it. There's no Apple ID attached uh, onto this device. Uh, you can see by simply don't have an Apple ID, create Apple ID. You see, now this phone is like fully functional. See, I can do it. It was super simple. And remember guys, if you want to do it yourself, go to safeunlocks.com. You don't need to be an expert. Uh, all you need is basically a browser and that's about it. See you guys on the next video. And I hope this was very helpful for you.